Hey guys, it's Jordan here, and this is a scratch tutorial on how to make a platformer game, and this is part one. So today you will be learning how to make this. So your guy will be jumping up in the air and moving around, and there's going to be a ground, and we are going to be making a variable. Okay, so I just made a player sprite but you can make this whatever you want I just made a square and then and then I shrunk it to fit the screen so that's all I did for that you really need to make a ground and backdrop so I just made a green ground it can be any color whatever you want and also you can make the player sprite way better than mine and the ground way better so, in data, you should make a variable called y velocity. This will control what will happen when it's in the air, and it will control the jumping. In backdrop, you have to create, so you have to say when the green flag is clicked, set y velocity to zero. Because, as you can see here, there's a lot of things happening, and this will just restart it. Okay. So, here. We're saying when the green flag is clicked forever, if the if the key space is pressed and it's touching the ground, then we're gonna set y set y velocity to fifteen. And what this is gonna do is if it's touching the ground and we're pressing and we're pressing space, so and then it's gonna set y velocity to fifteen. And this will not work because you have to add this. Change Y to Y velocity. And so what what should happen on your screen? So if you are pressing space and you are touching this, the green, and the way you do that is if you press this, and you actually press your ground, it will do the same color as your ground. So if you both these things are happening, then we'll set Y velocity to 15 and then what should happen is your guy should be just going up screen right now and you should just not fall back but just go up screen that's what should be happening on your screen if that's not happening then something wrong is happening just rewind and rewatch my part and so this part so this part all it was doing was um Basically, all it was doing was making the jump system, but this code will make the jump system complete. So, you do when the green flag is clicked forever, if else, you have to grab an if else block, touching color green, then set y velocity to 2. So what this is doing, if, if it gets stuck in the ground, it will go up. We'll be talking more about that in later episodes, though. Um, and then here, it's change y velocity by minus one. So, so this is this is if it's not touching the green floor or the green ground. It's gonna be this is what's doing. It's going down minus one. If it's in the air, then it's going down. That's all it's doing. So at this point, you should have this when you press. When you press space or whatever button you made it, you should be doing that. But you shouldn't be moving here. This part is really simple. And just forever, when the green flag is clicked, forever. If key right arrow is pressed, then change X by, by 5, which should be doing that. And then if left arrow is pressed, then change X by minus 5, or negative 5, and should do that. So yeah, that's, it's, that's the simple... This tutorial is just so simple. That's that's all it. It's so easy, just to make your player do this. So good, uh, good job for doing this, and just good job. So thank you guys for watching. Bye.